The tremendous spring of gushing lava sitting underneath Yellowstone National Park could emit sooner than already expected, researchers examining the range say. Investigation of minerals in fossilized fiery remains has verified that amid past ejections there were changes in temperature and the run-up that happened substantially more rapidly than beforehand thought. An intense ejection happened approximately 630,000 years back, as per National Geographic, shaking the locale and making the Yellowstone caldera, a bowl around 40 miles wide that incorporates a significant part of the recreation center. The spring of gushing lava is big to the point that a noteworthy ejection may stifle the Earth's air with fiery remains. Specialists at Arizona State University investigated confirm from that ejection and trust that the super fountain of liquid magma was awoken after two floods of crisp magma streamed into the supply underneath the caldera. Be that as it may, while the well of lava could have annihilating outcomes if it somehow happened to eject, no one needs stress right now. The quickened course of events demonstrates the temperatures around the spring of gushing lava expanded over a time of decades, rather than the hundreds of years researchers had beforehand trusted the procedure would take. It's stunning how little time is required to take a volcanic framework from being tranquil and staying there to the edge of an emission, Hannah Shan Lu, the examination's co-creator, told the New York Times. Things being what they are, what might happen if spring of gushing lava somehow happened to emit tomorrow? Contingent upon the span of the ejection, the spring of gushing lava could cover real segments of the United States in perilous slag and the Earth's environment would likely be loaded with that same powder. Powder in the climate would cool the planet, crushing life on Earth in the event that it didn't disseminate rapidly.